What's up you guys? It's your girl Sandra. Welcome to Sandra Said What? Um, today I have another good topic for you and uh, we're going to be talking about unemployment and is it making people lazy? Let's get into it. Thank you for joining me. If you are one of my day ones, welcome back. And if you are a new subscriber, if you are just joining us for the first time, welcome. And don't forget to become a part of a clan by subscribing. And, you know, let's discuss the fuckery. Um, today we are going to talk about unemployment. I saw this article that was saying that basically unemployment is making people lazy and... As we know, since the coronavirus hit, a lot of Americans had to join, had to leave the workforce because it was unsafe and for a lot of our health. And that was part of trying to slow down the coronavirus from spreading by, you know, closing down a lot of places and people had to get unemployment. So since people have gotten unemployment, even though some of those places have opened back up, a lot of people are not wanting to return back to work. I saw this article that was saying, is unemployment making people lazy? And I would like to address that. Okay, let's talk about it. We live in a capitalist society. I'm always going to remind you every time we talk anything finance on here because it's very relevant to the subject matter. What that means is we work for co corporations and glo <laughs> global con conglomerates and we work for rich people okay so i'm not understanding why it's hard to believe that we do not want to go back to kill ourselves for people who don't give a crap about us the way the workforce in america is today may i don't know if it's ever been better i would have to live in that time to tell you the difference what we do know is a lot of people are extremely unsatisfied with their jobs they are overworked and underpaid since the industrial revolution that's how it's been people are working themselves to the bone working themselves to death only to be replaced right before their funeral so I'm not seeing the problem what is the problem because people are barely living their lives you are let's say people see the average work out um, week is 40 hours a week you're spending 40 hours a week that's not counting the time that you take to get get up get dressed you know, take a shower, get dressed, drive to that motherfucker and come back and then take care of your family. You barely have time for your family. You're making minimum wage or you know, whatever you're making. It's not even enough to sustain you, sustain your life and your family. So you, a lot of people have to do overtime, which is work more than 40 hours just to keep their lives going, just to be able to afford to eat, just to be able to afford somewhere to live, just to be able to afford a car to drive to that motherfucker, just to be able to afford health care because we're doing hours and hours and hours on our feet and the human body was not designed to work like that. We are doing heavy duty that we were not designed to do as people. So, I don't think unemployment is making people lazy. I think people are finally getting some time off to enjoy their lives. A lot of people spend 20, 30, 40, 50 years in jobs that do not care about them. And if something happens to them, they will be replaced right before their funeral. Um, so, why should anyone who enjoys working? Let's be real. Nobody enjoys working. What I mean by that, nobody enjoys going to McDonald's or Burger King or clocking up in an office just to... Nobody likes that shit. First of all, waking up early, you don't get to spend time with your family, you don't get to live your life because you're always at work. You don't get to enjoy the house that you're paying for because you're never here. You're always at work. You don't get to travel. You don't get to eat the healthy foods that you should eat to keep you healthy. You're always on the go. Who wants to work? Nobody, not I. I do believe in entrepreneurship I do believe in I don't believe that you know you have to quit your job just because you work for yourself you're on your own business but I do encourage any and everyone who is able to start their own business to start it any and everyone who is able to make passive income to make it there are a lot of ways to make passive incomes including writing books including um, giving advice including doing social media work marketing a lot of that so I don't see the problem again with people not wanting to get up at 6, 7 in the morning to drive to a place that they don't like, be around people they can't stand, to work 
themselves to the bone for people who do not care about them. No unemployment is not giving, making people lazy. It's giving people the chance to finally live life as they should have, to finally enjoy themselves as they deserve to as human beings, to be able to afford to travel a little bit, to be able to rest their bodies because when you're working 40 hours a week, you don't sleep well, you don't eat well, you finally get to spend time with the people that love you, people that care about you, or if you choose to spend that time alone, that is you. So I don't think, again, Unemployment is making people lazy. It is that narrative that you have to kill yourself for conglomerates who could not care about less about you, who do not know you even exist, except on their payroll. Okay? Americans deserve to live happy, healthy lives. People are always frustrated. People are always angry. And part of the reason is because you're always working. You are overstressed. You are on going mode. You are not a robot. You deserve to rest. You deserve to make money. You deserve to be happy. Let people be. Let me ask you this question. If you had the option of sitting at home, enjoying time with your family, or traveling to a place where you can experience different culture traveling to a different country where you can see things differently enjoying a happy healthy meal that you can actually afford um, having a day of just sleeping to recover and let your body rest as it should would you pick that versus waking up at four or five o'clock in the morning to go to a building that you cannot stand the sight of to spend hours there to drive home and be tired and repeat the whole process the next day. Which would you choose? Is that laziness? Absolutely not. There are smart ways to make money and it does not involve killing yourself for, again, corporations who couldn't care less about you. So this is say I just said what and I said it and I mean it and this is hoggery and I had to discuss it. Anyway, you guys, thank you so much for joining me. Letting, let me know your thoughts in the comment. How do you feel about what I said? Um, do you think I'm tripping? Or let me know. Okay, so I will talk to you guys later. Bye.